What's up, Scorpio? What's up, twins? Welcome to my channel. I hope all of you guys out there are doing well. So, Scorpio, this is going to be a twin flame reading. I've already shuffled, meditated over your cards. If you feel like anything that I'm saying in this message resonate for you guys and this reading resonates please don't forget to like share and subscribe so let's go on and get it to a scorpio we ain't trying to waste no more time so the first card we have here this is messages to music and we have her damage so if you're not familiar with this song hey go to youtube type it in read the lyrics but i feel like one read this two ways scorpio i feel like one some of you guys could be feeling very damaged because of this twin flame connection or this twin flame journey. And I'm going to say this, Scorpio. It's okay to feel damaged. Feel your feelings. If you feel damaged, if you feel like a man or a woman scorned, however you feel and feel those emotions, but just don't stay there, Scorpio. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like a lot of us, we're good at masking our feelings. We can be broke down on the inside, bleeding from our doggone heart, but we walking around skipping with a big old smile on our face like everything is okay. But I feel like for one, Scorpio, we need to like... Take accountability for our actions. And if we feel damaged, if we feel hurt, if we feel disappointed in our twin and what happened on this journey, it's okay to feel that way. Just don't stay there, okay? All right, then we have, I think about you all the time. So I feel like for some of you, even though you disappointed with your twin, you know, you feel damaged, you still think about your twin. I mean, this is the other half of you. You can't help but to think about them. But I feel like this is more of your twin's energy, okay? I feel like this person is realizing what they've done in this connection, okay? This is someone who was wearing a blindfold and didn't want to take accountability for what they did. But I feel like slowly but surely, that blindfold starting to come out. This person starting to realize the things like they're going through some type of awakening, okay? And I feel like they're realizing, like, man, I did a lot of damage to my Scorpio in this connection, okay? And now this person's saying that you deserve better than them. Like, they realize that they did a lot of effed up stuff, you know what I'm saying? And this person just, like, I won. Like, I feel like this person, they want to come back. So for some of you, you've been wondering, does your twin want to reach out and communicate? Yes. But I feel like this person is embarrassed right now. You know, it, at first, they didn't give a dog on what they was doing on Scorpio, but now they done had time to think, especially if you're in separation and not communicate with them at this time, okay? And they realize, my Scorpio deserves better than me, okay? And they're saying, your twin is saying, they still have some growing to do, okay? So they're saying right now, they're not ready for you, Scorpio. They feel like you deserve better to them because they realize they, they messed up. You know what I'm saying? They realize that they messed up, and they realize that they are messed up, okay? And this person's realizing that they have a lot, they still have some growing to do. I feel like they have grown some. They had to grow to be able to be in this energy to acknowledge that they have done some damage. But I feel like this person has more growing to do. So let's see what type of energy is going on in this connection. Okay, so Scorpio, we got money. So some of you guys are about to get some money, honey. You about to get some type of financial gain, okay? That's what I'm talking about, Scorpio. Get that doggone money. So some of you guys can have some type of money, some type of financial gain coming towards you. Then we have questionable friend. So some of you guys can have some type of friend around you. Like maybe you've been questioning this person. I'm going to read this two ways. Some of you is the friend you've been questioning, like, the things that they say and the things that they do. And you've been wondering, like, is this my friend? You know what I'm saying? Like, this don't sound like a friend to me. And then some of you guys, you can have a friend around you. Maybe this is a male or a female. And it's like, you know, you and this person, you see, you see them as a friend. But you're starting to question, like, do they see you as something more? You're starting to question, like, maybe does this person have some feelings for you, okay? Then we have someone not wanting to be held accountable for their actions. So I feel like this is why your twin is saying they're not ready and they still have growing to do because they're not ready still to be held accountable for their actions. They're realizing their actions and what their actions was and what they did, but they don't mean they're ready to be held accountable. They don't mean they're ready to apologize and let you know. And then this questionable friend that you guys can have around you, this could be a hater, okay? For some of you, I feel like it could be someone who may have a crush on you or something. And for some of you guys, this question, my friend, is a hater. Whoever this is that you've been wondering, you know, does this person really love me or care about me? Nah, they a hater. Okay, so watch your friend, Scorpio. All right, so let's get into this energy. Let's see what was going on in this connection with you and your twin. What messages do you have for my Scorpio today, too? Okay, so we have balance. I am trying to find a way to bring stability to this situation. So right now, Scorpio, your twin is trying to find a way like to balance the scales. This person realized that they messed up, okay? This person realized that they damaged you and that they caused a lot of hurt and pain. And now I feel like this person is trying to figure out, like, how am I going to make things right with my Scorpio? I'm going to say this now, Scorpio. This is probably going to be a part two video. <laughs> 
I already see it in my future now because I want to pull some tarot and I don't see us getting there. Your twin is realizing that they are very selfish, okay? This is someone who who does, who does did things that would have the best outcome for them or that they would benefit from, okay? So I feel like for some of you guys, if your twin possibly had to like make a decision or if they were dealing with other people, you know, maybe they felt like you weren't the best outcome for them. Like they feel like other people out there could be better than you or they could find someone better than you. But like what a what a day I'll say they can find no one no one likes you, Scorpio, okay? But you was dealing with someone that was very selfish, and now they realize, like, because they were so selfish, like they have to find some type of way to balance out the scales in this situation. Your twin could have been someone who was around low vibrational people. Or this is how you met your twin when you and this person were both vibing at a low energy. But this person could not elevate because they were surrounded by small-minded people, okay? So for some of you, your twin could have possibly gone through like some great things in life. Like they possibly could have been questioning their purpose or, you know, they just had some goals. But these people that they were around, you know, these people didn't want to elevate. These people was cool with, you know, getting their government assistance. And I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with it because, hey, we all probably, I done been on government assistance too, but I'm saying they didn't want any better for themselves, okay? They was cool with, you know, getting their whatever they had going on and not trying to get out there and work a job, okay? So this person was cool with whatever they was getting. And they didn't want to see your person elevate. They could have seen something good within your person, but because they was low vibrational, you know, they want they didn't want this person to elevate. For some of you, your person was like a mystery to you. It was like you couldn't quite figure this person out. It was because this person they want to reveal them true selves to you. So it's like your twin just gave you a little bit at a time. Like they just let you see a little bit of them. They really never showed you who they truly were, okay? So it's like, you could have felt like your twin was a mystery. You know, you meet people, you ask them basic questions, like, you know, when your birthday, what's your favorite food, what you like to do, whoopty this, whoopty that. But I feel like with this person, you know, like, they kept it at that surface level. Like, they didn't get no deeper than that. You know what I'm saying? They didn't talk about their childhood. They didn't talk about their past relationships. They don't be talking about what they got going on now. Like, they kept it at a very surface level relationship with you and it's like you feel like you didn't know this person like i don't even know him like how can i be a him or her like how can i be in love with someone i don't even know then we have blindfold i'm not blind to anything i just choose to see what i want so for some of you you could have felt like your twin possibly like had feelings or emotions for you but maybe you felt like they were blind but your twin is saying they weren't blind to anything they, they chose to see who, what they wanted so they chose to see that they was messing up and really didn't care you know what i'm saying all right, Scorpio, meet me. We're going to do a part two video for this, okay? So if anything resonates so far, please like, share, and subscribe. But I'm doing part two.